everybody always wants to know, what did my ancestors do? What did my ancestors contribute? Because in a way that's saying, I am an important person by heritage. But when that heritage isn't known, then obviously a huge portion of your self-image goes down the drain. And that's why it, it's so important, I believe, you know, to, to take that young six-year-old boy by the hand and walk down the street and give him a black history lesson and point to his shoes and say it was Jan Motzliger, a black man who invented the automatic shoe lasting machine. And he steps on that clean street and you tell him it was Charles Brooks, a black man who invented the street sweeper, those machines with the big brushes. And down that street comes one of those big refrigerated tractor trailer trucks and you tell him it was Frederick Jones, a black man who invented the refrigeration system for trucks later adopted for airplanes, boats and trains. And it comes to a stop at the red light and you tell him it was Garrett Morgan, a black man who invented the traffic signal. And you can tell how he also invented the gas mask that saved lots of lives during the war. And while you're talking about the war, Henrietta Bradbury a black woman who invented the underwater cannon made it possible to launch torpedoes from submarines and while you're talking about black women you can talk about Madam C.J. Walker a black woman who invented cosmetic products for women of dark complexion was the first woman of any nationality in the United States to become a millionaire on her own efforts and you'll walk past the, the hospital you can talk about Charles Drew and his contributions to blood banking, the understanding of blood plasma, Daniel Hale Williams, the first successful open heart surgery in the world, and an operative mortality rate of only 1.5%. Um, you can talk about um, Louis Latimer, who was the uh, right-hand man of uh, Thomas Edison, a black man, who came up with the filament that made the light bulb work for more than two or three days, who invented the electric lamp, who did pioneering work in incandescent and fluorescent lighting, who diagrammed the telephone for Alexander Graham Bell, tremendous inventor in his own right. Almost no one knows of him. You can walk across the railroad tracks and talk about Andrew Beard, the automatic railroad car coupler, which spurred on the Industrial Revolution, or Elijah McCoy, automatic lubrication system for locomotive engines. And he had so many great inventions, people would say, is that a McCoy? Is that the real McCoy? Which is where the term comes from. One of the greatest inventors in the history of man. And people don't know that he was a black man. And, uh, you know, that's how you remedy the situation.